one, Adam Pecorero from Flex Serrero Fitness here, and today we're going to be watching the awesome Queen Kelly do her workout. The very first exercise um, is two parts. You know, she starts with a split stance deadlift or a split stance RDL, Romanian deadlift. It's a great lower body posterior chain exercise because it loads the glutes and the hamstrings with less spinal loading than the normal bilateral deadlift. It's a good progression if you're working towards a one-legged RDL, but more than anything, I'm asking Kelly to work through this because I think it teaches proper posterior weight shifting and it enhances neuromuscular balance and coordination. Now from this split stance deadlift, she steps into a front-loaded squat, which switches the load-bearing emphasis from the calves, hamstrings, and glutes over to the quadriceps. Now remember, that's the load-bearing emphasis. It doesn't mean you're not using those muscles. It's just what we're emphasizing. Now she does one side for a minute, and then her next round is the same exercise on the other side. But we're going to skip ahead. Kelly is doing a skier swing into a shoulder-loaded reverse lunge and then stepping back into a parallel stance with a shoulder press. So there's a lot of coupling of different exercises here. And the first part develops power in the hips and the posterior chain. And you've seen us do this before with either this exact same exercise or with the kettlebell doing the classic Russian swing. It's a fast twitch movement, a nice complement to the slower movement of the previous exercise. And the reverse lunge is for the quadriceps, but a different plane than the previous exercise. And then the shoulder press caps everything off, providing a high muscular demand in this compound movement series. Now Kelly is training the alternating lateral lunges, which develop balance, stability, and strength. And they work to strengthen and tone your inner and outer thighs. This is a great shifting weight exercise, again, in a different plane than our previous exercises. The dumbbell juggle not only adds weight to the lunge and the athletic dynamic of timing into the mix, but I think it helps to make the exercise fun too. It's always a plus. cap off her hit set, Kelly is doing one minute of burpees. Nothing fancy, just good old classic burpees. Down, kick the legs out, hit a push up, bring the knees in, and then jump at the top. Burpees get your whole body working. They're great. And when performed correctly, burpees should work the muscles in your legs, your hips, your abdomen, your chest, your arms, your butt, your shoulders, just about everything. They're fantastic. Oh man, they are a great exercise. In fact, I'd love them if I didn't hate doing them so much. They are very demanding. There's different ways to progress on them and you can always step instead of jump and you can stand instead of hop, but the big thing is to be patient and try to progressively build them. Even if you just did one at the end of each workout until that's so easy that you find yourself doing two and then three and so on and so forth. Great job, Kelly, what an example. Hey everybody, thanks so much for watching. It really helps if you click that like button. And I love hearing from you, so please leave a comment and I will respond. See you next time.